Hi, my name is Bernie Maloney of Powered by Teams, an Agile consultancy based in Silicon Valley here with a cautionary tale for those of you new to Agile and looking to transition into an Agile job. So this is a real life tale. Today is April 17th, 2024, when I'm recording this. I've heard about this stuff on the internet, but this was a real life situation from one of my recent students who had a background in education, is looking to transition into Agile, particularly as a Scrum Master. Now, their background, they have some coaching of youth sports, that's a pretty good fit for being a scrum master. They forwarded to me this note and said, hey, after two rounds of interviews, I've been offered a position. Have you heard about the company? Well, on the surface, from what I see from the URL, no, never heard about them before. But one thing caught my eye just in this intro note. One, that they would be meeting with their supervisor on teams, on, with a hiring manager, and then they would be meeting with their entire team for onboarding on Zoom. Two different services, it kind of struck me as a little bit odd. Well, I did take a look at the other documents that were provided. They looked pretty standard and boilerplate, kind of talking about company holidays and things like that. Um, so I wrote back to my student and said, no, I haven't really heard about them, but you should definitely check them out. That's when something interesting came up. My students said they had asked for their account number and sent them a check to deposit in order to purchase equipment. Whoa, I've heard about these scams on the internet. So I let my student know, be super careful about stuff like that. Um, and so yeah, they had sent something that looks like a check and yeah, they had put my student's um, number, uh, the bank account number on that check. Well, luckily, I think my student kind of caught it in time. Um, and I want to let you all know about stuff like this so you can be a little bit more informed. Um, I did a little bit more digging. And based on the URL, um, I used a service that's free on the internet. It's called Whois. And you can look up a domain with that and you can get a lot of information about the domain. One thing that I noticed right away was the creation date for the domain was only one day before this note was sent to my student. Okay, that, woo, that sounds a little odd. Um, something else that was really interesting was, well, they said they're in New York, New York. Um, the New York zip codes all begin with ones. Okay, I just kind of know that because I used to grow up on, I grew up on the East Coast, but that zip code looked a little odd to me. So you can go to the U.S. Post Office and look up a zip code. Um, that zip code does not exist. Whoa. Okay, go a little bit further on Google and you can find out mm, when you ask where is that zip code, it gives you some very interesting stuff. Another thing that was over there was a phone number. So I kind of did went to another search. This is called truepeoplesearch.com and did a phone number lookup and you can see no records. These folks have records on pretty much everybody. So this just sent off a bunch of alarm bells for me. Let me let you all know how this scam works for those of you in job search. Um, they, you apply online, you talk to some real life people and they say, congratulations, you got the job. Now we're going to send you a check because we want you to buy some equipment. You can go ahead and deposit that check. Um, we're kind of prepaying that. And, oh, and they'll tell you, by the way, uh, forward that equipment to us so that we can get it initialized for your work. It's only then, because those purchases are pretty quick, that you find out the check bounces and you're out the money and they're nowhere to be found. So if you are new to the Agile space and you're finding things like this, do be super cautious. Now, I did let you know my student had provided them an account number. I let them know, talk to your bank. They already had. Luckily, they'd been smart enough to give these folks an account number that was pretty inactive. So they were even protected that way. I do want you all to be safe out there from these bandits that are seeking to prey on people that are looking for jobs. Um, I do wanna help you along your agile path. If you found benefit in this video, sincerely spread this out to your network so that they don't get caught in this trap. And also consider liking, subscribing, and sharing here on the Powered by Teams YouTube channel because we post videos with helpful tips about agile in usually less than five minutes. Until our very next video, be well, stay vibrant, and thank you.